Now to host Farm to Fork, adapting to feed the world, please welcome entrepreneur and author Ndidi Okonkwo Muneli. Hello, my name is Ndidi Okonkwo Muneli and I've spent most of my adult life trying to change narratives about Africa. For me, it started in 1991 when I moved to the United States for college. I would mention I was Nigerian, and more times than I could count, I would hear, oh, I listened to Live Aid. Is that where the famine was? Or when I was a kid, my mother would say, finish your dinner, because there are starving children in Biafra. And you know what? There were starving children in my home country. But that was in the 1960s. There was a terrible civil war. Starvation was used as a weapon. And all over the world, the face of hunger was a little Nigerian boy with a distended belly. The problem is that many people have not updated that mental image. It's easy to forget that the world was a much hungrier place 60 years ago, whether your country was at war or not. But then something remarkable happened. The percentage of hungry people around the world shrunk more than threefold even as the population doubled. How did this happen? A key reason is that researchers developed new, high-yielding crop varieties. Harvest multiplied, a billion people were saved from starvation. It was called the Green Revolution. But that revolution is now over. Market shocks, new wars, and climate change, especially climate change. All of these shocks are combining to threaten food security once again. And there's also the growing challenge around nutrition, the green revolution's blind spot. Since it only focused on growing more food and on quantity and not quality. Sadly, a healthier diet was never part of the revolution. We are at an inflection point in our history as hum humanity. We have to collectively decide, do we go forward or do we go backward to a hungrier world? Or do we build a planet where everyone has access to a healthy and affordable diet? So that's what we're going to be talking about today. And it's my great pleasure to be your guide on this journey and to introduce our first speaker, Bill Gates. All right, just watch over that there, Mark. Welcome, Bill. Hi, thank you, Indy. 